Javed Saab, uh, my young friend Sanil Satcher, Sanjeev, Justice Rajinder Satcher, <coughs> ladies and gentlemen, friends. It's uh, always uh, extremely intimidating to speak after Javed Saab does because his uh, erudition, his eloquence, his breadth of knowledge, his expanse of creativity is something which has uh, always uh, humbled us and uh, inspired us. When uh, Sanjeev asked me to be present here, and uh, he and I go back a long time in life as friends, you know, I was just wondering to myself as, uh, as to why is he inviting somebody who's so intellectually challenged when it comes to creativity to be at uh, such an uh, august occasion. Uh, I did grow up in a tradition of uh, poetry and uh, the literary arts in my, my home. Uh, but uh, unfortunately, uh, my knowledge uh, or my acquaintance with poetry, as Javed Sabe rightly pointed out, uh, has been very cursory over the last uh, couple of decades. And uh, I think, Sanil, uh, you will stand out as an inspiration for a lot of young people uh, who not only have uh, reignited the passion for the creative arts in themselves, but as Javed Sahib was rightly saying, have the conviction of courage to put it out in the public space. Uh, I must confess that uh, though you were kind enough to give me your book, but uh, I have not really had the time to go through it. But one thing I'll pro I would read it for the sake of that uh, I think uh, we have a lot to learn from the younger generation. We have a lot to learn from people like you who maybe have a different perspective of the world than the one that we grew up with because things have dra dramatically and drastically changed in the entire communication landscape of this country in the last five or seven years. So without much ado and uh, without del delivering a long, boring and rambling uh, speech, let me conclude by saying that uh, it's wonderful. And uh, keep it on. Don't hit a creativity block. We look forward to more poetry and more books from you. Thank you.